Joe Beermaster. I'm here at Cabela's. I'm going to do a quick review of the Otter box cooler and the Yeti cooler. First of all, this one goes for $249. This one goes for $399. It's 18. That means it holds about 18 cans. This one holds 20 cans. Just real quick, it's made the same way as the Yeti. It's got the insulation all in there. It's pretty deep, but the only thing I noticed it has a plastic lid. It's got some exterior pockets. And it comes with a strap. So you can carry it around. It's pretty light. It's not real light, but just give you a quick view of that. Let me show you the Yeti, which is truly waterproof. And to open it, it's kind of tough. This has got the same insulation on the inside as on the, on the top. It comes with a strap. And some other odds and ends, but um, this is really lightweight. I wouldn't say real light, but it's got a little weight to open. It's very light. It doesn't have any other pockets. And it looks like a cloth material, but it's like a plastic. So it's up to your preference. I don't know which one actually keeps it cold, but if you want to keep something cold for three days, most people don't need something cold for three days. They'll go with the Yeti. This one doesn't perform as well, but this is a little more expensive, a little lighter, and it is waterproof, but the downside is the zipper, which is very difficult to use. So it does work. So that's your quick review. Please watch my other videos and subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.